at this Randy Olive, right? He just said, I asked him if he liked olives. He said, my last name is Randy Olive. Uh, Randy Olive. <laughs> I do love olives. I love green olives. I love black olives. Do you? No, not really. No. No, I, I mean, I can eat them. They're okay, yeah. but it's not at the top of the list. Okay, so you wouldn't put those on your charcuterie board? No, but I would still eat them. <laughs> He's still oh, yeah. going to eat them, Jessica. Of course, it we're back in great. the kitchen with Jessica. It does. With So Chatty. All right, tell us about this lovely charcuterie board, Jessica. So what we have here are lots of meats and cheeses that you can use with our um, first product from True Essence. And mm. so what it is, it is uh, fruit nectar. And so what we have done is we have taken fruit and it's brought it. seed in it. Oh, no. <laughs> you guys didn't see that on camera. That's okay. And we've taken it down to a honey-like substance. So oh. everybody knows how to use honey, right? Oh, yeah. And so what you would do is it has that pure fruit flavor of a tart mm -hmm. cherry. But um, in honey. Yeah. Do you use this to kind of dip or do yes, you drizzle? Yes, you could drizzle it all over the charcuterie board and enjoy it. Yes. Can, can you dip it in there? I mean, you could, you you could dip it in there, too. Okay. I'm going to drizzle. Look at that. Look at amber so drizzle. cherries and cheese. I like oh. that. Well, salami. Mm -hmm. And you know what, Rand? Yeah, We're not yeah. done here. Because oh, guess what's in front of you? Ice cream. Ice cream. Let's go we down this way. We ice cream. Yep. Okay, what do we have here, Jess? So we have two easy, simple, no-churn ice creams. No-churn ice cream. No-churn ice cream. How do you cream. do this? So it's really simple. You take two cups of heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream. And you cream. whip it together. What's the difference between heavy whipping cream and light whipping cream? There, I don't think there is a light <laughs> whipping cream. So. <laughs> Why don't they just call it whipping cream? I you know, so. right? Uh. Oh, the questions we have. <laughs> <laughs> and then what you do is you, um, in a separate bowl, you mix together some vanilla, okay. one can of sweetened condensed milk, okay. and a jar of our beautiful fruit nectar. So this is pure fruit flavor, and while I stir this together, I would love for you guys to try some. I will huh. be happy to oh, so yeah, this, right there, okay. The first one I have here for you is our crisp apple. Okay. And so what we've, what we've done is we've taken the technology from our chocolate, and we have applied oh, wow. it to fruit juice, and we are applying it to all different kinds of foods, huh. and that's, we hope to use our good. technology. That's really good. That's yummy. What, what, what kind of this is? This is crisp apple. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. It tastes a little bit like wine. Not that I Does don't want wine. Uh -huh. No, I can see <laughs> yeah. that though. Yeah, but yeah. It's, it's so it's such a concentrated apple flavor, right? Yes, it's good. And so what's great is for mm. bakers mm. or anyone who wanted to add flavor of fruit but not water yeah, we'll to their yeah. cooking, you can use these. That's smart. Yeah, that so would do what's it. great. And so then I have yeah. here a finished mm -hmm. product, so all I did was uh, throw these in a, you could throw them in a um, bread pan, I'm sure everybody has those at home, and <laughs> put some saran wrap on. Yes, we do, yes, we do. <laughs> and uh, throw it in the freezer overnight, and in the morning you'll have beautiful no-churn ice cream. That is fantastic. So we have cherry and peach here for cherry? you guys to try. Oh, and peach. Amber, which, which one do okay, you Okay, I'll try? do the cherry. Okay. All you right. Do what is this kind here? This is... And this kind is peach. Oh, I thought it looks like vanilla. It does look like vanilla, yeah. but it's, oh, it's, it's going to so, have a lovely peach flavor. It's so creamy. Yes. Creamy and tart wow. and sweet at the same time. It is good. So see Very how good, easy yeah. that was to make what? your own ice cream. Mm-hmm. I, I didn't know you could do yours, I bet you. <laughs> I bet not. Mm -hmm. I guarantee mine is. Hey, girl. <laughs> Ooh. Right here. That's good, too. Oh, they're both good. Wow. I'm going to that one. <laughs> so you're a cherry fan. Yes, I love absolutely. It. I don't know. I delicious. love them both. So what's great mm -hmm. is you could use any of the different fruits, and um, what's also wonderful is this is shelf-stable. Oh. So now we're bringing that stability. I want to make this at home. This yeah, is really good. Yeah, why don't you do really that and bring good. some in? Okay. <laughs> I know, bring some in another day. Okay.